Farming gold is an art. It's a skill you learn to master. It's not given to everyone. Only the true committed will succeed. Hey guys, Kelly Willy here. Just as promised, I gonna make you a sniping guide. What is sniping? Basically, sniping is really simple to explain. Basically, what does sniping do? You have to go to the auction house here. Click on it. Swap to TSM. And then you're going to see this sniper and run buyout sniper. If you run it, it will start scanning and it will keep scanning until you actually find something that can be bought of the auction house and be resold for a higher price. Okay, that's basically really the simple explanation. I'm not going to make it too difficult for you. If you want to start flipping on the auction house, all you have to do is go to sniper and press. Give me a second here. Press run buyout sniper at the top here and then you're going to see start scanning and then it, it will start scanning. It will not scan now because I emptied my sniper just to make this guide. So we can see step by step how I do it and how you can do it. Okay, let's go to the first step. We're going to talk about implementing sniper into your auction house um, browser basically. So the first thing you're going to have to do of course is install TSM. Just watch my TSM guide, it's pinned at my top screen. Okay, so the very first thing you're going to do is you can make your own groups, but I'm going to make it way simpler for you. You can go to basically to the TSM group site. Just type in Google TSM groups and it's the first link you're going to find. And you will end up on this page here. As you can see, I am already in the group page here. Yes. So basically what you're going to do here is you're going to search for a group. As you can see here, Group name. These are basically groups that are made by other people. Yes. So the first thing you're going to do here is you're going to search for a group. Yeah. Let us say all BOEs. Let's click on that one. That one sounds promising. This one has a lot of items with basically more than 100 items are in this group, only displaying the first 100 items. This means is all the BOEs will be in here. That is something you can flip. What else can you use? For example, classic. If you click on this one, I'm going to use this one, for example, because this is a flip I do a lot and that this is a flip you saw me do in my previous video, like Raptor Flesh. Basically, all the really cheap materials are in here. And the good thing about this one is you can double your gold with flips like this. OK, basically, the first step now you're going to do is you're going to import this string here. There you go. Import this string. Just copy. As you can see, it's not a big group, but you can make several groups. OK, now you will go back into World of Warcraft. Yeah, give me one second here. There you go. I'm back in the game now. And now you will close this window and you will go to the TSM tab here. You're going to see dashboard, ledger, groups, operations and settings. You will go to groups over here. You're going to click on import group, this small icon here, import group, import the string, just copy, just paste what you just copied, imported groups, there you go, import. As you can see now, my entire group has been imported into this window. Yeah, so now your group is inside TSM. If you want to make the group yourself, it will, it's the easiest job. It will take you a long time to do so. I highly uh, suggest search for several groups in that DSM group site and remove and add what you want. That's really simple. Just click on it. For example, as you can see here, I clicked on it and then you can press remove one item. If you don't want to remove it, just right click again on it. Okay, let's go to the next step now. Okay, so now you have all the groups you want imported, I hope. On the group finder so i added a few more groups here you're gonna see it in one second groups see enchanting patterns bo uh, these are all the 10.2 raid boes so we're gonna do a scan now and you're gonna see what it does but i'm not done after this i still got some explanation to do but first let's run out a buyout sniper running press over here scan post and start running it can take a few minutes before items will start to pop up but you're going to see that items will most definitely pop up. There you go. We're already getting some. I'm going to explain you the numbers. 
like for example here this one is the formula um primal frost this one costs around 17 it's sold for 17000 gold at a value of 80 so we can basically make 2% value on this. I won't recommend that because you're going to have your auction house cut. Yeah. So, for example, visage, visage of the devouring claim here. 175,000 gold. This person is selling this 22% cheaper than the normal value that it sells for. Yeah. So, for example, this one here is... The, oh, look here. This is a pet, for example. This pet is sold 30% cheaper, as you can see, and the list will go on, go on. The more groups you implement and the more items you implement, the more options you're going to get for sales. Like here, Scooter the Snail, for example. This one, what, what can you do as well, as you can see here? Um, let us take this one, for example, here. 70%, 200 and... 30, well, let, let us say 239.999. If you hover over it, your TSM also will say the region average daily sold. You have to keep in mind if you buy something, if you snipe something from the auction house like this, you can make a 30% profit on this, but it will take you a long, long, long time to sell because it only has a 0.006 sell rate, region daily average sold. So it will take you approximately over a year to get this one sold, but if you can spare the cash, I highly suggest you do it. Yeah. So it will keep running. You can do this. You can go AFK. You can do something else. Let it run for, let us say, 10 to 15 minutes. And then check if there are items you are actually after. As you can see here, I already got a few. See, and others will start popping up. Um, I got a huge list of pets because, as you saw in my other video, um, I, uh, from, I can't leave Stormwind for 10 days. I sold quite a few battle pets, yeah? Like now, 88% here, for example, Landro's Liching, 88%, that's a 12% value, so 2%. You always have to keep in mind you have a 5% auction house cut if you're going to sell it yourself, okay? Just let it run, and the list will be long, and then you can start choosing. I'm going to let the list run for a bit, and then we're going to go to the next step, because you got some small settings to do before it is completely optimized. So as you saw here, I let my, group, my groups run a bit. So these are basically all the potential cells I have. So if you want to buy something, be my guest. Just make your own groups and start buying up and making some money. The last thing I want to mention here, you can add sound to this. Yeah, Like you have several options. You go to settings. Browse Sniper, and down here, Sniper Options. Options specific for Sniper are below. And you can choose a whole bunch of sounds. Like you can choose a cash register, you can choose the rate of warnings, you can choose whatever you want, just pick one. I pick a simple one, otherwise my woe will be like, yeah, like a disco bar. <laughs> and that is something we don't want. So now you have the options to set up your Sniper, Go fiddle around with the groups you want. Um, if you're into bet pet selling, like I sometimes do, I basically have quite a few groups up, but search for the groups you want in the TSM group tool that I showed you at the beginning of the video, and you will be completely set. Thanks for watching, guys, and I'm going to make other TSM groups, but TSM is way too big to do it all in one video, so I'm going to do it in separate groups. You can expect more of this type of um content okay thanks for watching guys see you in the next video bye bye farming gold is an art it's a skill you learn to master it's not given to everyone only the true committed will succeed